Hi, Shane here. You're watching Sam for God. And this is Mark. Check her out. So, hi, guys. How are you doing? I'm currently in the little hallway of the Newport Bay Hotel in Disneyland Paris. And it's a beautiful hallway, in my opinion. It's a beautiful corridor um, because of the beautiful, like, blue stripes. Blue is my favourite colour, if you didn't know. And these are two of my favourite blue shades. So, beautiful. And this is the floor as well, which I also very much like. It's very nautical themed like sailory stuff. It's really cool. And um, we've been staying in this room, number 4352 on the fourth level. This is the door, lovely and white. And I thought I'd give you a little room tour because it's a beautiful room. And it's my second time staying here. Well, my second time as an adult. I think I stayed here once as a child as well, but I don't really remember it. But um, yeah, I think I'm staying here as an adult and I absolutely love this hotel. It's one of my favorites here. So come along on the journey. Right, so. We enter the room and we see a daisy having a oh, pooch. Hello. Hi. Oh, you, have you been expecting me? Oh, <laughs> thank you, you thank you. Thank you very, very much. Well, this is a lovely place, isn't it? The beds is where obviously I'm gonna first start, I think, because they're the first things that you see. Um, so I enjoy these hidden Mickey situations incredibly much, if that's even a sentence or a word. I've got the same thing going on here. This is the bed that I'm sleeping on. This is Daisy's bed. I love this thing here as well. Obviously it's kind of matches very much with uh, the whole theming of the hotel from what you saw outside. Same thing here, the beds here. Joke aside, Daisy, aren't they the most comfortable things ever? Oh, marshmallows. Literally, they're like, the best way to describe them, the pillows and the whole bed and everything is like, you're lying on marshmallows. They are so, so comfortable. And you've got these little extra pillars as well, which are just kind of themed with um, the whole hotel. So these are the beds. Uh, the wallpaper is kind of just like a wooden situation, I guess. I don't know, but what I like the most about the walls are the top bit. So you've got different characters. You've got, um, I was about to say Woody, Goofy. Um, there's some water here. It's almost like we're on a ship. There's Donald there, some more sea and ocean. Mickey is in the middle, looking absolutely cute, adorable. Stuff here, stuff here. The curtains are beautiful as well. I'm just gonna go around here though. We've got a random bird here, which I haven't actually named yet, but we can call him Peter. And we've got Pluto here as well. So, so cute. And this obviously is a connecting door if you wanted to stay, if you wanted to like have another room as well and attach them, but we are not doing this. Um, this is a, the television, which um, is currently just kind of showing bits of <laughs> Disneyland Paris. This is a random photo of a friend Mourinho, which um, there's a purpose of it, so if you want to find out more about this, you should watch my Disneyland Paris vlog. Um, and what's this again? This is like a nice ice bucket situation? Ice bucket. There you go, so you can get some ice. We're, we're actually on the same level as the ice cream, which is really convenient, although we haven't actually gone to it at all, have we? Um, and then, oh, this doesn't even open anymore. We haven't got anything in these, have we? We haven't. Okay, it's just like random bits and bobs. If you're obviously staying here for longer than like we are, because we're only staying here for two nights, um, you can then put your, you can unpack. I'm not a person who enjoys unpacking when I go on holiday. Are you? No, I never do. I just never find it like, stressful because then obviously when you're leaving, you have to make sure you pack everything back and like, what if you forget something? And then we get this um, lovely little desk and this mirror and a daisy and me, hello. And this is like a plug situation, very convenient. I mean, these, are, they, these don't come with it, oh. obviously. There? No, so what, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. That's useful. That's so useful. Oh my god, that's amazing. Um, that's my laptop here. We get little drawers here as well. Like, oh, does this open, Daisy? You tried it yesterday. It doesn't open, does it? Oh. Well, apparently they don't open these ones. But we get two little chairs as well. These are these are little bits and bobs. They're kind of both the same. Again, nice little kind of blue stripey situation. The floor. Look at it. The carpet's like, it's got little hidden Mickeys, which are very, very cute as well. I love it. And I guess that's pretty much it. And although well, the last thing that I want to show you, which is one of the most exciting things about this room, and we were very lucky to get it, is that we are actually, we actually have a balcony. Obviously it's dark, it's night time now, so you probably can't see much, but the curtains, can we just, I'm gonna go out for a second. Have a little look, how do I, oh, there you go. Oh, it's quite cold actually. But there you go, we have this whole, Room four balcony area. And there's another one over there as well for, for the room next door. And you can see, kind of see, 
uh, top of the top of uh, Panoramajik, the balloon. And in, if it was daylight, you could also even see a bit of uh, Space Mountain, which is really, really cool. We can see the swimming pool down there as well, which obviously we haven't been to because we were only here. We we're only here for like a couple of days, but. Um, you can't really see much at the moment because it's dark, but it is a pretty cool view. And just the fact that we have the option um, to have this balcony is amazing. And obviously, if we were staying longer, I think we'd be making uh, a lot of use out of it. So, that is that. Oh yeah, we do have this situation here as well, of course. The little bedside table that almost every hotel has. Um, and the bathroom as well, obviously, I have to show you that. To be fair, it's not that exciting, the bathroom, but as somebody who loves the colour blue, I do actually really appreciate just the colour of it. So, we are inside. We get this situation going on. This is me, hello. Um, I'm wearing a Beauty and the Beast top at the moment, which is rather exciting. So we get one sink. There you go, just standard. Some, uh, what's the word, towels. Um, the mirror is quite nice and big, and like three little lamps over there. A hairdryer, which is very convenient, of course, says Disneyland Paris on it. Um, we've got our toothbrushes here. Um, it's almost like it's Elf and Glinda. Feel free to guess which is which, so leave comments down below if you're really bored and let me know which one you think is mine. And then, this is the situation. You can actually, you've got a separate door, so you can like close the door if you're obviously in the bath and people can still use the sink, which is very convenient. We've got a safe here as well, by the way, which we haven't used. Um, and even an ironing board. This is Daisy's suitcase. And yeah, this is the bath. Very standard bath. But what I like the most about this is this bit here. I just love the shades of blue, I think it's so beautiful, really, really nice. The shower's nice, the fact that you can move it, I love it. I don't like showers that you can't move, like they're completely fixed. If you can move it a bit, it's still fine, but the, the ones that are completely fixed, I just don't enjoy, so this is really nice. This, you've got this random bit here where you can like, just see it, like, <laughs> casually gonna sit here whilst someone's gonna be showering here. Don't really understand it that much, but it's, I guess it's good to put your like, when you're showering, you can put your like, stuff here. Um, clothes and stuff and this bit is very very blue as you can see like you might as well just start singing the song guys I'm blue da ba dee da ba da da ba dee da ba da it's very blue but um, again I like it some people might find it a bit too much and the toilet's just a standard toilet here if you definitely need to see it but there you go um, so yeah this is the little room tour I guess of the Newport Bay Hotel oh yeah when you come out of the bathroom you've got this like long mirror which is again also very convenient you know in the morning when you want to get ready and stuff so yeah thank you for watching are you a fan of this room daisy yeah it's lovely it's beautiful um leave comments down below let me know if you've ever stayed in at the, the newport bay hotel if you if you want to stay here if you like it from what you've seen you think it's something that you'd enjoy like the kind of like theming of it if you like it and stuff and um yeah thank you for watching i'll see you next time bye